think Arnie's infer infertile. Roll. Intro. Good morning. From a nice, bright, not as warm as yesterday. Southwest of France, La Charente. Yeah, thanks for all your lovely comments yesterday on yesterday's video. Um, li living with anxiety in France, I think it was, or anxiety in France. Um, yeah, everyone has anxiety. Um, yeah, you know, thanks for all your openness and being candid about it. That's uh, it, it a brave thing to do. Uh, you have to add a comment and bear your soul within the comments, so thank you for that. Yeah, so you're filming today, filming tomorrow, um, filming a bit Monday and then put the next one out Monday night, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I think that works, doesn't it? Gives me the weekend off editing then, although I do enjoy it, so it's a bit, oh, I don't know. So, yeah, nice. So boring though, do it. I don't mind doing the top field. Um, the hill, I enjoy doing because it's dangerous. <laughs> Because the lawnmower wants to tip, so I find that fun. Uh, but the ball field, so boring to do because you just go around and around in circles. I said to Lisa before, I said, I'm not you know, you're thinking about not doing it um, anymore. But the look on her face meant that I am. <laughs> so I said, I'll do it if if the family are down there playing. At least I can have some fun then and watch the family. But but down there, it's, you can't even see the house, see, see the roof of the house. It's a bit lonely. Anyway. <laughs> um, Lisa's got to clean the hens out today. I'm going to, I'm going to get out on the bike. Lisa's going to a garden centre tomorrow. Um, Kathy, one of our neighbours. No doubt you'll get a veggie patch update. Um, and apart from that, I'm not really doing much. I've got a cold saw. I used to get loads of cold saws as a kid. Um, and, and as an adult, they're, uh, yeah, they can be anxieties stress related also related to your changes in temperature you know so it was a nice day yesterday um it's only the third cold saw i used to get about four or five a year horrible horrible things um i've only had three in the time that i've met lisa you know so that says something um i had one when we came back from vegas then another one and then and, and then this one i find if you ignore it don't keep nibbling it or biting it. It tends to go away, but uh, but this one's growing. I can feel I can feel it throbbing on my lips. <laughs> yeah, there's somebody that uh, that's come say hello. I'll show you. Hello, sunshine. Hello. Oh. <laughs> Apparently, nibbling's a sign of affection. I've still got the marks on my arm. <laughs> So when I was mowing the bottom field yesterday, I noticed our fences have been knocked down. I think uh, the farmer's done it. I don't, don't think he did it on purpose. They're all rotten posts anyway. But I think as he's uh, put barbed wire down, because I think there's going to be cows in that field. Um, anyway, I'll show you. Yes, yeah, so we've got like brand new. Well, because this fence post's fallen down, that's annoying. Be able to touch it, touch it to that. No. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna prop her up with that. <laughs> Temporary. Stops the dog getting out, getting shot by the farmer. Anyway, that's the bottom field. Yeah, so if you imagine me sat on my lawnmower, like really lonely look, that's all you can see. <laughs> Anyway, if that topic yesterday about anxiety just just popped into my head. If, uh, if anyone else has got questions out there that, that one answering, it doesn't have to be about anxiety, it be about anything. Uh, just put them in the comments. Try my best to answer them. Anyway, right. Let's go back up the hill. Let's, uh, let's do stuff. <laughs> He's still going, look. 
no way. <laughs> anyway, hell yeah. Morning. Seba. Huh. Right. What do you need? Huh. You're right. Let's do a leg check. Three. Oh wait. I was going to go in and do stuff. But a notification popped up on, on my phone about a comment. Really made my day. Um, hope they don't mind um, me mentioning them. Uh, anyone for music, thank you. Who said that um, they'd never heard the expression um, hypervigilance and over-catastrophization before. Um, I'm playing the clip over to uh, the husband who nodded. <laughs> And agreed um yeah it is real yes yeah, definitely real um like masking behavior i'll talk to you a little bit about that as well that's uh it may it may resonate with some anyway i'm gonna swap arms i think masking behavior is something that um that we all do to some extent anyway yeah we've got uh who we are with our family who who get to see the um the good sides and the not so good sides of us sometimes um and then we've got the persona that uh we put on to yeah to others you know like if we go to work and stuff like that if we meet people for the first time you know we tend to we tend to calm down the swearing <laughs> um you know we cage people's responses to uh yeah to humor and stuff like that but um but with me swapping arms again the amount of times i heard when I had um, my issues back in 2019, call it a breakdown if you want. Um, the amount of people that came up to me said, you were the last person we thought that would have a wobble. We thought you were the last person. And that's because I'm really, really good at masking. Really good, too good. Uh, but you had to do it, you know, so, at a fairly senior level, you're within police, a load of responsibility, uh, managed and led um, a large team of detectives. Um, you know, so, um, as Spider-Man says, <laughs> with great power comes great responsibility. Um, you know, you've, you have got to be the leader that, that people want to be led by and have to be led by. Um, which meant that uh, each day I'd put my suit of armour, is what I called it. Put on my shirt, tie, shoes, polished always. Shirt, nicely pressed. I haven't had a shirt in six months. Um, as in my clothes now. It's like I've gone the complete opposite. Um, and yeah, I would, I'd get in my car and then boom. Here I am. I'm the uh, I'm the person in charge. You come to me for advice. Come to me for guidance. Come to me for leadership. Um, and I'll do my best, regardless of what's going on in my life, and regardless of what's going on in, in my head, uh, regardless of how I feel. And you know, you're to a, to a lot of extent, you've got to do that. But um, I became too good at it. Uh, I've got to be honest. Um, I don't know where I'm going with this story to be honest with you, but yeah, um, have a have a look at yourselves and see whether you two have got this this masking behaviour, which is good if it's um, if it if it helps, but if it's disguising who you really are as a person and people don't really know the real you, then maybe they're going to have uh, expectations, um, you know, that you can't deliver on. Catches up to you. <laughs>
So many hours have passed since uh, since we last spoke this morning. Um, I've been out on my bike loads today. <clears throat> Went to La Roche Foucault twice. Uh, one to go and see whether um, there were any greenhouses there. I think it's called uh, La Serre de Jardin en France. Um, on the website, it showed that, that they had none in stock. Oh, they did. So I had to come all the way back and then bring Lisa with the car. Right, I'll show you. So it's a polycarbonate one. The glass ones, you're looking over a thousand. This one uh, came to uh, 250 euros. So 190 by 190. Um, yeah. So it comes in, in that bit and that bit. So, so we'll put that up tomorrow. All right, laters. When you're down and you stare at your window, hoping that you'll come up with some words to say. That's not okay. Horrible, horrible greenhouse. It needs to be an octopus. Yeah, horrible. I'm gonna do the rest tomorrow. All right, so the eggs have been uh, in the incubator for seven days. So what we can do now is uh, candle them, which means that you shine a light through, and then uh, check to see uh, how they grow. Right, let's do that. Right, so apparently, the first week, they're meant to look like, I don't know, is it that one? So apparently that one is not a good one. So, either infertile or early death. Fourth so, one is not a good one, and fifth one's not a good one. Yeah, so There's one or two. One, one or two, right, okay. No, that's not, that's not a good one. Right, we're going to give it another week and candle them again in a week. Made the decision then. I'm not, not going to be responsible for murder. Good morning from the southwest of France. It's actually France. We say France. <laughs> You're southern. Anyway, Monday. Need to do this today. It's going to rain for the next seven days, I think, on and off. Showers. Um, Sean's coming today to do the floor in the office. Uh, Sean's here. I can see him. <laughs> right. We've got the uh, we've got the school run. Let's do that. We see some feedback on the last video. So I didn't do the sunglasses thing. Well. It is a bit cold, I thought the sun's out. <laughs> Q, slow mo. Let's do that again. Q, slow mo.
Oliver. Right, back from the school run. Oh, I just wanted to put a few people's minds at rest <clears throat> in relation to uh, Unique. We've spoken with the uh, with the neighbours, um, and uh, right, they're completely French, <laughs> and uh, we've managed to get an agreement to feed him apples and carrots. Not cake, apparently. Apparently, cake makes him angry. <laughs> There's an ingredient within the cake that makes him angry, uh, from what we can gather. But uh, not to feed him every time we see him, otherwise he will um, expect it. And when you don't feed him, he'll get angry. So if sometimes you see me feeding him, sometimes you don't. That's the reason why. Anyway, got some, got something to show you. Isn't it funny how hens drink? <laughs> When I think about the way we used to be, when I think about the things it took from me, I know that I am so much better, better. When I look at what I've done, now that we're apart, when I look at what I've won, I've come so far. I know I'm so much better. Oh, and baby, you don't belong. I could feel it in my bones. There was something going on. That shade of doubt hanging around. That old. Cause darling, there is nothing right. When all you seem to do is lie. Those days are gone. If Hitler and Stalin had a love child, then that, that love child designed that. That's horrible. That's the hardest thing about I've, I've ever had to do. And I've had three kids under the age of 19 months. That was hard. I'd rather do that again than that. It's not done. It isn't done. Typical it's just typical instructions. Alright. Here's what it should look look like. Do that. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> Tomorrow's another day. If you like these videos, please subscribe. Just a thumbs up. That's bugger all. And a comment. You don't like a comment. Leaves one last thing left to say. It's not from me. It's not from him, who I've just caught eating cat poo. It's not from any of them. That's disgusting, you eat your own eggs. Ugh, oh, girl, I love your face. And it's not from the newly sprouted potatoes. Laters.